No, espérate, todavía no. Hi, hi, Debra. I'm right here. Hi, Ivy. Jorge, ¿no me trajiste la uña para hacer el chile? Ah, el arroz. El chile. Allá se quedó. Para hacer el chile, la salsa del chile. Ah, la olla. No, no duda. ¿Qué quieres que haga primero la salsa? Lo que se te haga más fácil. Voy a hacer el arroz. Ah, ok. Voy a ponerle aquí. Girl. Girl. No, 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 no. Hi, Corbin. From Maryland. Sorry, um. YouTube kicked me out. I think it's my Wi Fi. Um, my mother in law today, she told me, well, last week we made the pescado. I don't know if you guys watch it, but last week we made the tacos de pescado. And it was funny, my my husband asked uh, my oldest, uh, Nana's gonna make something to eat. Guess what she made? And she said, yeah, come here. You wanna say it? And she guessed, she didn't guess tacos. Hi, Angie! She guessed, uh, here, hurry up, because Nana's already cooking. <laughs> Sí. Okay, enchiladas sí, verdes, yeah. Uh, sorry, I'm gonna flip it over because my mother cookie, she cooks fast. So she's gonna start by making the Mexican uh, red rice, which is really known for, and you guys are gonna get to see it here on the live. But anyways, my, uh, my oldest was telling her, um, oh, I think she's gonna make enchiladas verdes. She's like, no, we're making tacos de pescado. Acá hay una. Ah, okay. Ya, déjame, déjame. Why? No, dijo que el que se iba por ahí. No, 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 ya, ya. Aquí está. Ah, okay, she's going to make it with that one. Yeah, so Edna said she wanted, uh, what's it called? Ay, 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 what is she? Enchiladas verdes. The ingredients are in the description. I made sure to put it. And also, too, there is a video on my YouTube channel on how she makes it. I just showed know what's for dinner. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay, so she's making the Mexican rice. So my mother-in-law. <laughs> Hi Madeline. Hi Kelly. Hi Maria. Hi Charlotte. Hi Mom. Listen to me. Hey Michelle. Thank you guys for those thumbs up. Those that is our family channel. If you guys want to check it out, Familia Adventures. <laughs> so my mother-in-law is going to make the Mexican red rice right now. She's adding, she doesn't measure um, the rice, but she uses this bowl to measure it. And then in here she has oil. She just used some vegetable oil and then um, this cup. I think this is about one and a half cups, but she uses two of these. And she's going to let the rice crisp up right now, like get nice and golden. And after it gets nice and golden, um, once it gets nice and toasty, she'll add uh, hot water. She'll just do double amount of water. Whatever amount of of rice she used, she's going to double that with water. And then she'll add tomato sauce and everything you guys will see right now. Um, in the blender over here. Ah, espérame que viene. And then if she... Uh, okay, there. Es que se sigue desconectando. Okay. Ahorita me hace decir que es lo que aquí está adentro, eh? I'm gonna be translating, okay? I always translate, but I'm gonna say it right now. If they're Spanish speaking, I will be translating. ¿Quieres la cebollita? Okay, in here, she already boiled tomatillos. ¿Cuántos tomatillos son? Dos libras. Dos libras, okay. Porque es para muchas sí. personas. Two pounds of tomatillos. In the ingredients, it might be more or less, but this is what she's using today. You guys can follow along that uh, okay. ingredients in the description and then she also has uh she's adding one fourth of a white onion to the blender so she already boiled them uh oh someone sent me messages <laughs> no and um cuantos ajos son tres o cuatro okay and in here she's adding five garlic cloves in the ingredients i have um four but she doesn't measure anything all the time it's different okay and then, uh, ¿cuántos chiles serranos? Ah, 
¿Cuántos chiles serranos tienes ahí dentro? Dos. 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 Sí, pues dos. And then she dos. puts two chiles serranos sí. in there. It's just to give it a little bit of spice. Hi, buenas tardes a todos. Hi, how are you? Um, and then look at, enseñale nomás aquí a la cámara cuánto le está echando. Mira aquí. This is how much um, North uh, Suiza, the chicken bouillon she's going to add. I would say about two tablespoons, three tablespoons. Uh -huh. Just follow the, the ingredients in the description. That one I measured out what she was adding one day. But then again, it's all the time different. Le va a la mitad o todo entero. She's adding one bunch of cilantro to the blender as well, and then also water, enough water to cover it. La agua es caliente, no? Si. Oh, and the water in the blender is hot. Yeah. And then she's gonna blend this up. This is to make the sauce, the, the sauce of the enchiladas verdes. A este? Yeah. El arroz? Quieres que la menee? Okay. Hi, Carter. Now that the sauce is uh, nice and blended, she's gonna transfer it to a pot. Um, I promise you guys that once you guys make this, if you use to buy the can, you'll never want to buy the can again. It's so good. Now, if you don't want it too spicy, you can add a jalapeno instead. Jalapeno? Si, si no lo quieren tan enchiloso, pueden echarle un A. Pero no le da el mismo sabor al jalapeño. No, ¿verdad? No. Nomás que le echa uno, Nomás que le pone uno, ¿verdad? Okay. So, I don't know if you guys can see me here. Maybe, yes. What's wrong? What are you eating? Eso? Uh, she said that if you don't want it so spicy, just add one chile serrano because the jalapeno will not give it the same flavor. Babe, can you see me in the camera or no? Oh, it's a little lag. What about right here? Okay. Get in this, mommy. Drink some of my cup right there. Why so long? Because se like so like so it can get mixed up pretty good because it's whole tomatillos and it's whole chile serrano. Nothing is chopped up. So in the blender she does it like that. If I do it in a like a Vitamix, like I have a Vitamix, it'll do it way faster. But I still think it was pretty quick. Aquí lo va a echar, verdad? Okay. And then my mother-in-law's name is Georgina and my father-in-law is Pancho, well, Francisco, but at least in Pancho. Let me. Pancho. She's going to add cheese. oil. She's making the cheese. She's going to add oil. Yeah, shredding the cheese. She's going to add oil to the 
the pot right now because then she's going to add the sauce to cook it up a little bit. Oh, yes, you can see me. Oh, what's okay? Ya lo mire. Oh, Julie, que I love your mother in law, dijo Julie. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> in here is where she cooked the chicken. She cooked it about dos horas. El, el, la pechuga, una hora. Oh, 40 minutes. She cooked the. Oh, good evening, Brandon. 40 minutes. Uh, the chicken. Chicken broth. Don't throw it away. I've seen so many people do that. No, no, no. Don't do that. That's liquid gold right there. That's going to be used for the sauce and for the rice. Uh, she uses chicken breast, of course, with the bone. Or I don't know if she used with the bone. But, anyways, uh, to there, she'll add. Uh, onion, no, no bone today, no flavor today. Le echó para hacer el caldo de pollo, le echó ajo, un poquitito de cebolla, sal, ajo, y un pedazo de cebolla. Okay, to make the chicken broth, all she did was add water, a little bit of salt, a piece of onion, and a garlic clove. Usó pollo sin hueso. Okay, today she used chicken without the bone. She normally doesn't do that. She always adds the bone because that's what's going to give flavor to the broth, but not today. Ay, dice, buenas tardes, Doña Georgina, Don Pancho, Cristal y Jorge. ¿Quién es? María, se llama María. No, Doña. No, pero que no, no, no. Está bien, está bien. Doña Georgina. Doña María. Ella es de Canadá. Ella es de Canadá, sí. Hi, David. We are doing good. How are you? So right here we got the Mexican rice going. This is gonna be for our enchilada sauce and then this is our chicken broth the chicken let me show you guys the chicken this is the chicken I'm gonna help her shred it right now and then I'm gonna show you guys my father-in-law and then some of the toppings we like to add uh, some lettuce let me show you my father-in-law really quick le voy a enseñar al pancho quieres saludar no. My father-in-law is shredding the queso cotija. Enseñale el quesito, Pancho. He's going to show you. I always talk about this cheese. The cheese. Right here. And he's shredding it. Remember, I always say it looks like Parmesan cheese. It does, but it doesn't taste like it. This is what we're going to add the cheese on top. Thank you guys for those thumbs up. Carol, they said hi, Papa. <laughs> Hello. Hola. Everyone is involved. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, look at my mother in law telling you guys. She's going to add flour. She's adding about two to three tablespoons. Each time she makes it, it's different. But I wrote the exact ingredients down below. Con aceite, ¿verdad? So it's oil and flour. She's just cooking that off to get the flour to taste off. But she's doing everything like at the same time. So while she's doing this, she's doing the rest. And she cooks fast. Well, I guess when you're not used to filming. Oh, there you go. Now the salsa. Here, let me move it this way. Hola. Mi tía se fe, ahí está. Okay, so there goes the sauce for the enchiladas already in, and now she's gonna just warm it up. Okay, and now she's adding the chicken broth to it. ¿Qué tanta le echa como la misma cantidad? ¿De qué? De la salsa o la mitad? ¿Qué tanto jugo le echa? Ah, unas cuatro de estas. Cuatro de esas, okay. Oh, uh, like Carol, you say I want to come to your mama's house and eat. <laughs> she said, well, she, you guys are welcome. Yes, she always says you guys are welcome as long as you can get your plane ticket here. One day, one day. One day, one day. One day. Okay. Okay, so that one in the blender, if you guys saw, she already put the uh, chicken bouillon in it. She doesn't add salt to it. She uses the chicken bouillon for salt. 
She's going to add a little bit more because it needs um, a little bit more. She says she always tastes it. Sometimes it needs it. Sometimes it doesn't. What's wrong with you? Jennifer, yes, in San Diego. I'm in Inglewood. I'm close. Yes, you are. Yeah, you are. About two hours. Yeah, I was going to say that two hours away. I'm not there yet. In Inglewood. Oh, it's not good. 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 Oh, la Carol says, I'm not that close. Yeah. Okay, she says it tastes good now. It's ready to go. Yeah, I'm going to put in the tapadera. Yeah. Oh, she's going to add one, one more. No, two. Chicken broth. Le a poner su tapadera a la salsa? O así lo has aprendido? No, le pongo la tapadera. Ah, okay. And there you go. That sauce is so good. And it was so quick. All she did was boil the tomatillos and uh, chile serrano. I, sorry, I'm off. Leo va a comprar. Brenda said he's in Texas. Un papel rollo, ¿no? No, ¿y tú qué compras? Ah, ok, ok. Uno, nomás había uno. ¿Eh? Oh, you're cooking dinner. Tacos de papa y tacos de frijol están haciendo. ¿Quién? Lupe. <laughs> okay, uh, what time is it here? Four o'clock? Marlene is asking. Yes, yes, it's four o'clock, Marlene. She's in Jersey. Wow. Sí, qué curioso que en la cocina nunca medimos los ingredientes, pero siempre sale por lo mismo sabor. Exactamente, Jennifer. Jennifer saying that in the kitchen we never measure, but the taste is always the same. That's exactly. Um, I I also don't measure anything, but sometimes I have to do it to just get the right thing. I'm making fried shrimp and tater tots. Ooh, that sounds so good. 702, 702. Carol. Um, I don't remember where you're watching from. Oh, everything homemade says, Estoy en Trinidad. Oh, en el Caribe. Son las ocho acá. Wow. Yes, the rice, she measures the rice, but with a bowl. This bowl, she uses it for everything. Look. So here she's making the Mexican red rice. Oh, thank you, Marlene. She says, I love spending time with you and your family. No, I love that you feel that way. To me, that's why I love doing these lives. They're like real time. Um, I know that it's like a little rush and I'm like moving the camera everywhere, but <laughs> it's we always have a lot of fun. So you see how dark she gets it? She gets it like super golden and toasted. Just, you know. Thank you. Planicino looks good. The sauce is already ready. That didn't even take like what? 10 minutes? <laughs> and here she's making her 15, 20 minutes. Yeah, she says like 15, 20 minutes. So she, before the live got, um, she got a head start and she cooked the chicken. And we have our chicken broth to the side over here. You don't see it on the camera right now. And then she boiled the tomatillos already before we got started. So right now Jorge is helping shred the chicken. And my father was helping uh, shred the queso cotija. Ah, okay. She said that you can also put como crema sour cream. Uh -huh. oh, okay. Crema del queso. Oh, queso, sí. a mí me gustan así. Sí, con crema. crema. So she's saying that you can also, um, as toppings, we use lettuce. We use, uh, we also use radishes sometimes, and then we also use uh, queso cotija. But she's saying that you can add sour cream. Oh, los rabanitos, los fireworks, los rabanitos. Radishes. Rabanitos, rabanos is radishes. 
So many Mexican moms and grandmas make it very different. My mom and grandma made it um, using fresh tomatoes in the in the blender. My mother-in-law uses tomato sauce, and I feel like this is just much easier. But there's many other recipes where you can blend tomatoes and onions and use that and add it in there. Her using tomato sauce is just easier. Okay, so now she's saying that for water, she's going to use the chicken broth instead. And she added two bowls full of rice. Now she's going to add four of those of chicken broth. De, de lo you? De lo, de del caldo de pollo, de caldo. Uh, of the chicken broth. Hi, she's seven. Faith, how are you? Oh, thank you. You're eating Doritos. Oh, those are our favorite chips. Ah, su mamá. Jennifer dice, mi mamá corta cebolla blanca y jugo de limón. Ah, le pone arriba las enchiladas. También todo lo puedo Rico. Hacer. Yeah, you can, you can use whatever you want. Jennifer saying that her mom adds sliced up onion and also uh, lemon juice. My daughter loves lemon. She would like that. Some people add cheese to it, like a Monterey Jack cheese, and bake them in the oven. We do not bake them ah, in the sí, oven, también. but you can totally do that. Okay. Georgia. Okay, thank you, Carol. I couldn't remember. I love when you guys tell me where you're watching from. I appreciate that. Thank you, guys. And today, my yesterday. Oh yeah, yesterday was a surprise. You guys want some cheese? Man? I'm not sure if she So yesterday we went out to eat and we did vlog. We have a fa family channel called Familia Adventure. It's a vlogging channel if you guys are interested. I know a couple of you guys already go over there and subscribe. Um, and if you're not, I would really appreciate you guys go over there. We're so close to hitting a thousand. We're like, how many? Five away? We're five away from hitting uh, uh, 1,000. Oh, Jennifer saying, ¿Qué parte de México son? My mother-in-law is from Tijuana and my father-in-law is from Mexicali. And we all live here in uh, Southern California, San Diego to be more specific. So we have a family channel and we went out. It was Sunday. We went out to eat. <laughs> Chicken, hi, hello from Florida. Hi, shout out to Florida. Oh, thank you. She really is. Yeah. So she says she also adds a little bit of pepper. You see, every time she makes it different. Yes. No. <laughs> she says that she put she puts black pepper and garlic powder. I didn't know that one. That's why I like watching. Antonieta, ella está mirando desde Jamaica. Te dijo que mom is really beautiful, muy bonita. Thank you, thank you. Yes, girl, almost time to celebrate 1,000. Isn't that exciting? And then now she's adding the chicken uh, bouillon. ¿Cuánto le echó? Como dos, tres cucharaditas. Me puse una y media porque son grandes. This is her spoon that she uses. No, but it's, it's que yo a big para... one. So she says she did one and a half. I'll say two tablespoons, but really you can add more or less. It's going to be up to taste. And you guys saw that she added that tomato sauce. She added the chicken uh, broth. And instead of adding whole garlic cloves, o oh, ya la tapadera quiere? Yeah. Okay. Instead of Adam adding whole garlic cloves, she used to, but not anymore, um, because somebody would always eat the garlic clove and they didn't. Want it. So she's. Uh, I, oh no! Um. Then. Uh, she now adds garlic powder to it. I didn't know that one. So you can add garlic powder to it, and she also add black pepper. That'll give it good flavor. Uh, Marlene says, are you allowed to congregate in church yet, Crystal? Yes, we are. Um, I have a couple of church vlogs that they'll be going up soon. Um, right now that you guys are on the live, and you guys are interested for tomorrow, upload for Familia Adventures. We went to the largest gas station, largest Chevron gas station, right? So it's like a quick, quick little two, three minute video you guys will see. 
New Jersey is very bad right now with the corona again. We do Zoom and worship nowadays. Wow. Well, we might have to do that again. Like, uh, not Zoom. We did it like another group uh, virtual thing because I don't know how it works in your area, but here in our area, it goes through colors, huh? And we might have to do a lockdown again, they're saying. Hi, Josephine. That Josephine Yandro. Hi. My mother-in-law said hi, Josephine. Hi, Josephine. Goose afternoon. Yeah, so we're close, we're close. So if you guys are enjoying this content and you're not subscribed to this channel, feel free to hit that subscribe button. But if you guys are subscribed and you aren't subscribed to Familia Adventure channel and you want to go over there, well, you guys can go subscribe over there right now. Um, we'll put Hi Familia in the comments so you guys will see it. So, do you need to right now? So, if you see that Familia Adventure with the blue little tool and saying hi, that's Familia Adventure. We're so close to hitting a thousand. And when we do, we're going to do a giveaway. So stay tuned for that. Um, so what happened yesterday was yesterday we went out to eat, right? So after church, oh, really quick, let me finish telling you about the rice. Once it comes to a boil like it is right now, she's going to lower the heat. She's going to add the lid, and she's going to let it cook for about 20 minutes. Hola. Hola, Carpa. Buenas noches. ¿Qué hora son allá? Carpa's from Italy. Carpa? Carpa, se llama Carpa. Dice saludos. Está mirando desde Italia. Qué vuelto el nombre. Sí, ¿verdad? Carpa, my mother in law says beautiful name. Sí, es la primera vez que lo oigo. ¿Verdad? Es uno, es, Carpa es a very, uh, ¿cómo se dice? Un nombre familiar, no familiar. No, no, es el nombre es, en, no. en, en, en Italia, ¿no? Sí, es italiano. Italia. Italiano. Le que te estás. Son las, oh, son las 1 a 11 de la, de la mañana o de noche? No, pues la mañana ya. De la madrugada. Madrugada. Sí. Está ¿Sí? Mirando, ya es tarde, ya. Oh. Muchas gracias. ¿A qué hora duermen? Pues se duerme temprano, pero ahorita está... <risa> Están en live. Está bien. Ya aprendió a hacer el chile. Hey, Cassandra. También, está ¿También de Italia. Wow, wow, amazing. We have a couple of Italian viewers on the live right now, and it's so late over there. Okay, so pretty much the sauce is still on a medium heat. We're just letting the uh, Cook up and soften, no, not soften it, but thicken up a little bit. Ah, oh, besos, besos. Marlene, uh, Carpa says it's 1, 1 11 in the morning over there. Oh, Maria says three away from a thousand now. Woo -hoo! Oh my goodness, wouldn't it be amazing if we hit that thousand on the live? Oh my goodness, you guys will get all our reaction. It's 1 a.m., Cassandra says. Thank you, thank you, Cassandra, for joining us. Um, so yesterday what happened was this is the first time this here let me flip over the camera it's gonna be weird me talking like that so we're gonna be waiting for the rice to cook and the sauce oh here let me move the camera so anyways <laughs> so yesterday we went out to eat and what happened was um, we had to wait 50 minutes for our table and we were with my in-laws and with a neighbor and they're like, yeah, yeah, it'll be fine. We'll wait. And I was like, okay. We started walking around and we went inside this comic uh, bookstore Yes. and we were in there looking around and I was filming because I'm, I'm, I was vlogging. Uh, so we vlogged on yesterday, like church and then going out to eat and stuff like that. And a lady, her name was Lizelle. Lizelle. Hopefully I got it right. Um, and if I don't think she's on the live, but if she watches the replay, uh, she said, are you Crystal? And I was like, yes. And at first, my first reaction was, I thought I was in trouble. I don't know why I thought that. And she's like, oh, I'm a viewer. I watch your Costco hauls and uh, Familia Adventure. She said, I was watching the Las Vegas one. And um, it took me by surprise because I've never met a viewer in person. Um, I'm always interactive in the comments and in the lives. I feel like it's a real connection. 
But one thing, que pasó? Oh, no. But one thing is to, to meet you guys in person is like a whole nother thing. I thought it was pretty cool. It's just the hard thing that I had was that I'm a hugger. I like to hug people. And I know right now with everything going on, it's like kind of weird. Um, but it was so nice to, to meet her and to meet her in person. And she's like, at first I saw you and I wasn't sure. But then I saw you filming. And I'm like, yeah, that's her. And I was like, oh, my goodness. Like, it was so cool. It was like out of nowhere. Um, I always imagined like meeting someone, but never like it just took me by surprise. It was a huge blessing and a huge honor to be able to meet her. Because uh, like I said, it's one thing that I see you guys in the comments and we interact or another thing like um, in a live, but a whole different deal in person. Like I really wish I could have just hugged her, but I know with everything going on, that wasn't the thing. But we were able to take a picture, which was so cool. Uh, so stay tuned for that vlog. I'll put it um, in the in the vlog. She said that I am allowed to put her picture there. Yeah. She, she, she was sigue. very shy, but it, it was so cool. Like she sigue. No. Yes, the food's almost ready. A lo mejor no. Dile a Jorge a ver qué se puede meter. ¿En la chiquita? ¿La meter en la chiquita? I didn't say nothing. Oh. <laughs> yes, Marlene, so cool. It was so excited. So, like, it was such an honor. Oh, Emily, you want to say hi? Hi. <laughs> hi. <laughs> yes, it was a huge blessing. Yes, yes. Like I said, I really wish I could have hugged her because I'm a hugger. But then I have to respect other people's boundaries because what if, like, she's not a hugger? Okay, la mediana. Ya la echó en la chiquita, pero la va a echar en la mediana. Ah, pues ya ensució la chiquita. Hi, Gabriel. Yes, it was so cool. So, over here, Jorge is shredding the chicken. I was going to do it, but <laughs> he's doing it. And then, uh, oh, sorry, Mom. Uh, Shredding the queso cotija. Well, he's already done. Esto ya está. They said hi, Emily. Ahí está. Well, Emily shows. Ya está. Okay, she said it's ready already. Oh my goodness, Esme, are you ready? She's waiting for it. it smells so good. <laughs> Yeah. It, okay. My tooth came out yesterday. Oh yeah, your tooth fell out yesterday. Can I go? Este los rabanos. Si los rabanos, no van a querer los fireworks. So fast in 30 minutes, all done. No, just kidding. She's almost done with the rice. If we met Crystal, I'm hugging you and your whole family. I'm a hugger too. Ah, Josephine, that's so cute. Antonia, ay, Emily, so cute, thank you, thank you. Send to Colorado. Que mandes enchiladas para Colorado, looks yummy. Oh, she said she's gonna send it to you right now. Oh, thank you, Tikan. Sending the family hugs. Veronica, hello. Sending good vibes from Austin, Texas. Woo -woo. Austin, Texas in the house. Thank you, thank you. Hola, hola. I can only imagine how wonderful it smells in there right now. Yes, Madeline, it smells so good. Uh, Carpa says, what did you, what do you make? Like the minestrone? No, this is enchiladas verdes, Carpa. I used to make minestrone a long time ago. Um, this, my mother-in-law, she made enchiladas verdes. She makes her sauce from scratch. I'm gonna open it really quick. ¿Cuál plato? ¿El de la Betty Boo? ¿Pollo? No, 
Oh, thank you, thank you, Antoinette. Two away now. Two away from hitting 1,000. Woo! That's awesome. I know it's just a number, but once we hit 1,000, I could go live on my phone on that channel. So let's just say one day, not one day, we're here like all the time, or they're over there, I could just go live on my phone if we're on the road or something. Ocupan un pla uno, uno más grande, dice. ¿Tiene más que las ahí? Sí. Mira más grande la mano. ¿O quieres mejor un plato nomás y pon los pechulos? Come on, a thousand. Woo -woo. Oh, thank you, Cassandra. That means we're one right away. Woo. Cassandra says, ya, ya casi le vamos a pegar al mil. Ay, ay, ay. Uno, falta uno. Uno. Thank you, Cassandra. Viene, viene, viene. Yes, I'm going to check Crystal to see how. Oh, woo, woo. Thank you, thank you. Let me see it. We could probably check right here. Let me check. I'm using George's phone. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we're 99. Look at that. Look at that. George's phone's a little crack. Matt, can you see it? Nine, nine, nine. One more subscriber. Hola. La tablita para qué? Para cuando la reina se pique aquí. Ah. No, no sé. She got that little, uh, the, ¿cómo se dice tablita en inglés? Table, table. No, tablita. Ah, no, table. It says really hit, it says really hit a thousand. Who said we hit it? ¿Cómo se dice? Maria, we hit the thousand, Maria? No, we didn't. No, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. No, come here, come here, come here. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let me <laughs> check, let me no, check. Uh, hi, hi, Kim. Okay, they're saying that we hit the thousand on Familia. Let me check. No, we didn't. I'm going to freak out right now. Mommy, you think you're about to cry. Oh, my God. <laughs> Thank you guys. Don't cry because they always start crying. Don't cry. Don't cry. I <laughs> are super excited. The thing is that this channel started off as my girl's channel. Uh, but the thing was that YouTube made a lot of rules, so we had to switch it up to a family channel. And they said, that's fine. We're happy with a family channel. Oh, come here. Oh, is this So it's like a boy, my people. Oh, she's crying. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. So sorry for the people who came to watch and she loved us and hear my daughters and I are crying. <laughs> I'm not excited. <laughs> we are so grateful and thankful. We're the thousand. Oh, thank you, Marlene. Thank you. Thank you, guys. They're saying congratulations. They're saying hi or no? Oh, my baby. No, Brandon. Uh, the food's almost ready, so you're right on time. Oh, my goodness. De que parte de Latinoamérica son? Latinoamérica. No, no, pues están preguntando nomás. Ah, no, pues Somos de Tijuana. De, de Tijuana. Mi, mi suegra es de Tijuana y mi suegro de Mexicali. They're asking what part um, they're from. Pero Latinoamérica? ¿Así se dice? Latinoamérica, pues sí. Oh, okay. México, pues, Ooh, good Lord Jesus. Thank you. I always wear waterproof <laughs> mascara because this girl can cry. Hi, Vanessa. Oh, thank you. Thank you. 
We just hit that thousand on Familia Adventure, so thank you guys for making that possible. I promise a giveaway, so we're gonna be doing a giveaway on that channel. It's gonna be a Starbucks cup, so it's gonna be international. So I don't care if you're from Canada or from all the way out, what is that place called, Antarctica? We're gonna send it to you. Don't worry, if you win, we're gonna send it to you. I don't care if it costs more than the cup. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. We're going to be doing a giveaway. Once this channel hits double digits, we're going to do a bigger giveaway. So stay tuned because we're on the live. We're getting all the cheese men. Oh. Guess what? My, my wish came true. Your wish The fountain? Yeah. Oh, when we were in Las Vegas, we did the wishing fountain. Her wish was to hit a thousand subscribers and we, we got it. Wow, what a blessing. What a blessing. That was your wish too? I wish we could have a dog. The wish was a dog? Yeah. What the I'm so sorry that we screamed too loud. We probably screamed way too loud. Thank you, thank you. God bless you, Crystal. Congratulate. Thank you, guys. We appreciate that. And glad you made it to the live, Vanessa. We just hit the 1K. I think it's over. Oh, my goodness. Thank you, guys, so much. Thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you, Carol. You are so sweet. I can't remember my blank, my head goes blank. I don't remember what it's called. Cutting board. Cutting board. Cutting board. Cutting board. Oh. <laughs> I'm not translating that because she said something else. Thank you, Jennifer. I can't. Sometimes my brain goes blank. It's a Oh, thank you for watching from Philippines. Thank you, thank you. No, Oh my God. No. Oh, <laughs> Carol, you're awesome. You are awesome. Thank you. That would be crazy. Yeah. Wow. Wow. We'll be visiting you for sure and cooking for you guys. How about that? <laughs> we'll do a little tour. I've always wanted to do that. I like it. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Carpa, I like that one too. The only problem with that one, the, the, the Pioneer Woman one, the only problem with that, oh my goodness, I feel like it's way too up. The only problem with that cutting board, it's so pretty, but when you cut all the lines, you can see them. But overall, it's a cute cutting board and it works great. Ya mira va a estar el arroz, ¿verdad? Ya está. Oh, the rice is ready. You want to see it? A ver, enséñale el arrocito, Georgina. This is the night after the one that Nana. Mira. Wow. Thank you, Josephine. But overall, Carpa, I love that cutting board. It's so cute. Hicimos arroz para dos días. Hey, she said we made enough rice for two of them. By the way, love the Costco haul. Thank you, thank you. It's so good. Right now she's gonna get another little pan and she's gonna put oil in there and we're gonna do it to soften the tortillas. Hi, Ivy. Right? She said que el arroz se ve, ¿cómo se dice magic? Delicious. También delicious. Oh, you sent me a message on Instagram? Okay, right now I'm live on my phone, Ivy. But after the live, I'll, I'll, I'll see it. Oh, Cassandra, thank you. I dream of going. Se ve magico, huh? Oh, okay. Thank you, Cassandra. I appreciate that. Um, since you guys are on the live, last week I was supposed to upload the video of how we organize our uh, Costco haul. I still didn't get to put it up. Would you guys like to see that on Wednesday? Si, si. Let me know. ¿Quieres que te ayude a picarlas? No, no, no. No, pues. No, no, no. 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 No, no, Okay, Angie says you want to see it. Okay, I will definitely have it up. Um, 
last week I was just too tired and I couldn't get it up. But I was like, you know what? It's going to almost be time to go to Costco again. And I feel silly for putting it up. But if you guys still want to see it, I will definitely put that up Wednesday. Getting all the cheese in. And then this Saturday, I'm going to have a... Uh, an upload like a bonus upload so stay tuned for that too that one's just gonna be um it's gonna be a fun one it's a big collab that i'm doing with a bunch of other lady youtubers but it's gonna be a fun one uh can i make official teaser the smell so good oh i need to give you guys a plate huh hold on i'm missing some of the comments anton it says yes wednesday's fine thank you thank you i would love to see that video Asked if y'all having difficulties with the video earlier, you'll see it. Okay, I will, I will, um, I will check that, Ivy. Ah, sí. Los rabanitos. Los rabanitos para los cuerpos ambulantes. And Ivy, I will check after this live, huh? Yeah, celebrating with, with um, enchiladas, as we said. Thank you, Carol. I'm so glad that you guys enjoyed that. You are a wonderful family and y'all deserve the best. Thank you, thank you. The food is delicious. Where's the plate, Mama? Right now, she's cutting up the, the radishes. We all offered to help, but she's like, no, I'm going to do it. I'll do it. Uh, the rice is ready. The sauce is ready right now. We put, thank you, Brandon. Thank you. We got the oil in the pan. Let me show you. The oil right here. This is gonna. We're going to start using it. These are the corn tortillas that we have um, for the enchiladas. We're going to soften them up. We're going to put them very quick. You'll see, I'll do that part. Because everybody else is doing everything and I'm just here talking. But it's just cold. I don't like to just stand and not do nothing. I have to go take my dog out. Good night, Chris. Oh, thank you, Madeline. Thank you for subscribing. We appreciate it. Good night, good night. Yeah, you'll see more of our family content over there. You gotta wash your hands. Rabanitos. I think I finished. You radishes? They're really good. Thank you, Brandon. And good night, Madeline. Thank you so much for joining. They smell weird, the radishes. Okay, well, they're not. No, they're good. I like them with the tacos al pastor. Oh my goodness. I don't know if I can eat a taco al pastor without them. <laughs> What's pink? They have like a like a peppery taste to them with some lemon. Are you ready? Lemon and salt. Almost ready. Aww. Oh, the arroz. Ya le puedo servir arroz a las niñas? Okay, let me serve up rice for the girls because the. Si, es la de la izquierda. Es la de la otra. Échala así, por favor, y lo vamos a hacer con. Oh, look at George shredded the chicken. He did a really good job. It looks fancy. When you were a baby, you would sneak pieces of chicken. Like your sisters too. Nope. And after that, they pretend nope. your little sisters pretend they don't like chicken. Oh, thank you. But why would I sneak a piece of chicken? Like just sneak it and eat it. Why? Because you were like, I'm gonna get some chicken. <laughs> Always get the rice from the side. Now you didn't. I'm just kidding. It's just so you don't mess it up. Oh, I just grabbed it from the middle because it looks so good. I like now that's clear. Cool. My mother in law said, make sure to serve a plate. I'm like, go, oh, yep, we're going to do that. Right now, I'm going to add them. Um, just to soften so that they're pliable to turn. Now, like I said, if you guys want to like put them in the oven, you can totally do that and put cheese on top. Some people do that. We don't, but in the oven, they would taste really good. All the sauce from scratch. Josephine, huh? 
Oh, she said, good job, Jorge. Oh, thank you, Brandon. We love you guys so much, too. You guys uh, have no idea how much you guys mean to us. You guys are like our family. Good night, everyone. Okay, good night, Carol. Thank you for joining. We're going to serve a plate up right now. Arroz? I got arroz. Oh, thank you. 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 Hair used to be really, really long. Mine is really long right now. What's long? My hair. The girl's hair is long too. Yeah, you said that you need Yeah. Sorry. Es una nueva la crema? Okay. Okay, the girls Why? like sour cream in their rice, so I'm going to add sour cream. Yeah. And then we're going to fix up the plate. I'm waiting for the oil to heat up a little bit. And then I'm going to soften the tortillas. And then I'm going to eat. But look at the, the rice. It's not that spicy. If you don't like, if you can't tolerate spice at all, it has a little kick, but it's okay for my daughter to eat it. But it could have a little kick. She does two chiles. She does add two chiles serranos, but you can always add just one. Um, if you add just one, it's not going to be spicy at all because the tomatillos have such a strong flavor that it will overpower it. So if you don't want it to be spicy at all, like don't you don't even want to take double chances. Okay. So right now, um, the live will go in and out. I'm so sorry. Oops. Hi, Tina. But we're still we're still live. 71 on the chat. 72 now. Woo -woo. Hit the thumbs up, everyone. Oh, Josephine, thank you. Thank you. Yes, yes, please hit those thumbs up. We appreciate that. If you're new, feel free to subscribe. We do live cooking over here. We do Costco hauls. Everyone loves the Costco. Yeah, you know, like the right. Right. Can you add one more place at the table? Oh, yep. yes. Uh, we will invite everybody, but we will. We would, but everybody. Man, I look at it. Yes. Look at how good the rice looks. I love this part. One of my girls. I'm sorry, sorry. I love. Yes, I got it. No, no. Thank you, thank you, Josephine. Mama, it's not just Nana's famous rice. Nana's famous rice. I like that. It's Nana's famous rice. This is like me. Here, can you give this to to a friend? Yes, you can. Anyone can change. Anyone can taste it. Ah, falta la cuchara para que sí. Ah, el quesito. Carpa wants to taste it. Oh, Carpa. Yeah. Oh, you're going to be like, oh, oh my gosh. Yes. Debra said, favorite channel. Oh, thank you, Debra. Thank you, thank you. So sweet. Okay, this is for Emily. Can you give that to her? Thank you, everyone. Yo creo que ya está el aceite para empezar. Ya, ya está. Ahora sí, prendelo. Whoa. 
Yes, they do. Nana's make the best food always. Yes, they do. And they do it with lots of love too, Cassandra. Thank you. Thank you. What I'm gonna do, I'm sorry for you. No, I put it on. I'm gonna flip it this way. Can you still see? Like that, I can, I can see the comments from here. Yeah, I think we can still see. So I'm over here. I don't have my apron today. Normally I always have my apron. Mira, estoy hasta, oh no, ya cambió el noviembre. Oh, it is, it is so good. So I don't want this at a high heat. Let me lower it, huh? Can, is that a good, can you see it there? I share it, share it. Okay, hopefully you guys can see it. Hi! Okay. And we just want it like quick, 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 quick. Hopefully you guys can see this. And it's the plato de carton, Georgina? The plato de carton, ahí pongo la tortilla? No, no, las tortillas que ya están listas. Put them here. Ah, okay. Ah, ya está lista doble. So just like that, I try to drain off as much as the oil, so nice and soft. I'm gonna make a, a couple of them. We don't wanna deep fry this, this is just to soften. Now, if you guys don't like oil or anything, I would recommend if you have a non-stick pan like this and some good cooking spray to use that instead. Oh, thank you, Carpa. Thank you, thank you. Here, I can't really see. Okay, there we go. I can see it better now. My mother-in-law gave me this shirt. Try to angle it where you guys can see it. I love chicken when I was little. <laughs> Barnyard. Oh my goodness, that is so funny. You're thirsty. Did you get my cup? Mira que bonita se hinchó esta. I don't have Ooh, that one looks so good. Give me this. No, you don't try it like that. Say, give me please. Yes. Yeah. I'm gonna make a couple of them for everyone. Thank you, thank you for those thumbs up. You guys want to share this video, you can share it too. I would appreciate it with a friend or a family. Hi, how are you? I'm just um, adding the corn tortillas or tortillas de maíz to the oil just to soften them up a bit. I'm not uh, frying them. I don't want like a tostada. It's looking good. Wish I had some of that food. Oh, Brandon. Wish, I really wish we could send everyone a plate. My mother-in-law is so used to making big portions of food. She doesn't know how to make small portions. So if one day somehow we all cook and make food together, she would love 
both her and I would love to feed everyone. Got to go, familia. Congratulations. Oh, thank you. Good night, Josephine. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Ya sin chotra. Look at it. My mother in law loves it when it gets uh, goofy like that. Right? And that's just a plate for her. Oh. oh, you make yours with corn too. Okay. So I've never made it with a flour tortillas, Kim. Okay, let me finish up making, frying them up. Oh, look at she's going to cut it. Look, look at it. Look at how sweet she is. Oh, let me see. Look at she's cutting it for her. Yeah, I'm telling you. My mother-in-law says that she's my mother-in-law says she's a lefty, and it's funny because my daughter Esme is a lefty too, and also Estrella, she's a lefty too. My dad's a lefty too. Everybody's a lot of people are lefties. Oh, are you doing that? What's up, Sarsita? Thank you guys for those thumbs up. And 
look, and that's just by itself plain. She doesn't like to add anything else on it. She just likes the tortilla, the chicken, and the... Ooh, girl. <laughs> She's so happy. Thumbs up. Did you pray, mommy? <laughs> I'm so excited. I say thank you, Nana. Okay, we're going to pray. Amen, amen. Thank you, thank you. Bye, Angie. Thank you for joining us. Good night, she says. Susan says, I'm a lefty and all six of my kids are too. Wow, that's so cool. So I have three girls, Susan, and out of three of them, my oldest and my youngest are left-handed, but Jorge and I are both um, righties. Righties, is that people say that? Righties? My dad's a left-handed. Carp, I'm ready for a taste. I'm going. I'm gonna. I'm gonna pick some up for my in-laws too. Right. I'm not gonna put the hands. Oh, that's so good. Hey, you get it? The ice cream ice cream. Ah, no insulation, Tata. Hey, come on, Tata. Hey. Oh, yeah. I could be cool. Is that sauce? We want to. We want to. That'd be so hey. cool. Have... Just right now with everything going on, it's hard. With my mother and mom? Nana will be the chef. Um, I saw a question right now about if we can soften them in the in the oven. You can soften them on the comal. It's just it's gonna have a different taste to them. What I would recommend to do if you don't want to do oil, do very little bit, or if you don't want to do oil at all, use a non-stick pan. If you have a non-stick pan and some cooking spray, put like a good couple of sprays and you can do this and it'll taste exactly the same. Because when I make them at the house, I don't use oil. I use non-stick pan and cooking spray. But it's the avocado oil one. It's not like the regular baking spray. It's that avocado oil spray. And it's so good. Ya tengo bastantes aquí. No, yo las hago. No, que no se mueven ellos a comer, pues. ¿Quién quieres? En plato. En plato, en tarde y en Meant to tell you, I grew up in Southern California. I was born in Newport Beach. Ooh, I know where that's at. And grew up in Lake Forest. Ooh, that sounds like a nice place. Is it Lake Forest? Oh, no, 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 no. Her <laughs> it's her apron, her mandi. Oh, Sherry was asking if you can soften them up. Oh, sorry. You could definitely do that with the nonstick uh, pan and a spray. You could always warm them up also too in the microwave, but that tends to make the tortilla sticky. Okay, Kim, you do the same thing. Yo, yo. Uh, she uses the spray. Your right hand, okay. Oh, nona for grandma. Oh, in Italia se dice nona for grandma. Ahora te vamos a decir nona, Fiorina. Nona. I love it. So beautiful. <laughs> we call her nona. Get it? Okay, I cooked up a couple of them, softened them a little bit. Oh, se va a poner. ¿Quiere que las prepare o las quiere preparar? Las quiere preparar. Okay. Oh, thank you, guys. Oh, thank you. Here, I'm gonna put the food right there. Thank you for those thumbs up. I like how they're so supportive. Yeah, my two younger girls, they're not big fans of enchiladas, but they like the rice, so they eat the rice. And it has a chicken broth and all the good flavor there. Now, if you don't eat chicken and you just want to make these with cheese, that would also be a good option too. Jorge, te preparo tu plato? My mother-in-law, she's um, diabetic, so she has to put insulin right now. Okay, and then I do have um, a video how to make this step-by-step -step on my channel. It's on a what's for dinner. It just I forgot to link it in the description, but in the description of this live, 
I have the ingredients for this. Um, it's just a little bit different from today's, but it, you're gonna get the same results because my mother-in-law doesn't measure, so today she, her measurements were a little bit different. Huh? On the live, she did show how to make the rice. In that video, I'm not sure if I did, but I'll link after this live, I'll link how to make the Mexican rice and also how to um, make the enchiladas verdes. I forgot to do it. Um, but I will. But she did show in the live how to make it. Where is the Costco Business Center in San Diego? I used to go to Costco all the time when I lived on Cap Pendleton, but it was a normal one. Okay, where is the Costco Business Center exactly? No, because you can't see the happy face. I'm guessing it's like Claremont. Claremont? Claremont? So Claremont, if that makes any sense. So Sam. You're welcome, Kim. Oh, of course, Cassandra. Hi, Lisa. Jorge, ¿cuántos quieres? ¿Cuánto es ¿Eh? ¿Tres? Look, I already finished my plate. Oh, can I show them? Ooh. I already finished my plate. She finished. Is it spicy, mama? A little bit. A little bit. Saturday, Sunday, but I am back on Monday just in time. Finally, on time. Oh, on the live. Thank you, thank you. No worries, sweetie. Oh, thank you, thank you. They always cook good food. Thank you. Love you so much. Oh, the sour cream and the Mexican food. Dos. Y tú, Jorge, cuantas quieres? Let's get us some mucho pollo. Eh? Lo normal, ¿no? Why you telling? Huh? Maybe put more chicken because that's a little bit. Right now what we're saying is that there's this song in Spanish called Amor Divino and we're always singing it. Jorge is um, a righty. <laughs> My dad's a lefty. Technically Jorge is not Mr. Evans. He's Salgado. <laughs> we're, we're both Salgado. Yeah, I still have Evans on there. Ah, uh, look at my mother-in-law served it for my father-in-law. He likes a little bit. Boy. Esme's already on her third one. Ay, perdón, me picaron. Oh, oh, thank you, Cassandra. Thank you, thank you, sweetie. 
Love that you guys are always together and always happy. Familia es todo bueno. Yes, provecho. Thank you, thank you so much. Oh, thank you, Lizette. It comes on, huh? That song, the Amor Divino. Let me roll that again. I don't like that. So if you want to roll these up and put them in the oven, like I said earlier, totally can, but we don't do that. The good ones are like, if you go like that, the red one. Yes. Yeah. Doesn't really make it because my father-in-law doesn't like it. I don't like it because she doesn't want it. I don't care. I'll eat it. It's so good. Okay. Yo, échale lo que usted quiera. I love it. The red enchilada sauce. She makes it from scratch. I'm going to see if she makes it. Love you. You're inspiring. I like to make my fiance the same food. You make so beautiful. Oh, so, so because of he has an amazing lunch. Oh, thank you, Abby. Thank you. <laughs> My mother in law said, Don't tell them who it's from. And we're like, They could hear you. This is her kid. Look at all the rabanos. Those are all the fireworks. I like thank it. you, guys. I like it. I like thank you for the love, guys. I appreciate it. You guys have no idea how much you guys mean to me. Oh, thank you, thank you. That's really fun. Here, these are Jorge's. Sister Emily, please. I want to 
ya tiene sour cream, son muy buenas con crema también. Sí, con cremita, con otro fina Este molida. queso es como de patas, se pesa mucha pata, muy bueno. Well, It's called foot cheese, right? Yeah. Carpa says, I prefer three tortillas. Three enchiladas. Thank you, thank you. I'm going to serve myself up too. Ahorita voy a hacer más porque ya se And then after the live, because I can't have music on right now, we're going to put music on because we always do that. We put music on. And we all start singing. Yeah, we go a little crazy. The Ramanos is going to cause some fireworks. Uh -huh. You'll be part of it too. It's always a good look seeing the family eating at the table. It is, right? Thank you, Such a blessing. I'm good. Ella mira desde Jamaica. Jamaica. Thank you, thank you. You like Mexican food? Beautiful name. I'm going to add sour cream, Carpa. Don't worry. I like it with crema. Cremita. Ay, ay, ay. And then I like it with a lot of sauce too. It's getting dark, huh? Oh, I got some guy. Hey, uh, you said the sky. Emily, Estrella, no tablet at the table. You have to be with the tablet at the table. Come on, come on. Terminé de comer. Yeah, John, 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 John. Is everybody welcome? It looks yes, good. God yes. bless. God bless you too. Thank you, yes, thank you. Everyone's joined. You've everyone's never, joined. nunca comido Antonia. She says, I never eat it. Sonny says, it's every, yes, yes, Sonny. I know. Can I have two enchiladas? <laughs> yes. Yeah. And a bit rice. Two enchiladas with a, not a little bit, it's a lot. I like it very saucy too. Let me add all my toppings. about how we met met you earlier in the live earlier thank you thank you oh thank you you want to say hi look at all of us eating enchiladas verdes thank you thank you for commenting too <laughs> it was so nice seeing you thank you thank you sweetie for 
the super chat, Maria. Thank you. We're having enchilada. Thank you, sweetie. You're so nice. Thank you, thank you. Yes. I need like a special tambourine. Ooh, thank you. Okay, two enchiladas with rice, sour cream, and hasta rabanito. Rico. Chevron gas station. It's like a quick three minute video if you guys want to check it out. Uh, we do post on this channel Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And over there on Familia Adventures, we post Tuesday, Thursdays, Sundays, and we go live over there on Saturdays. So it's everyday content. Like, come on. <laughs> Every day, working hard. Good night. Besos and kisses to everyone. As always, thank you guys so much for watching wherever you guys are watching from and welcoming us to wherever you guys are watching and thank you because you guys made it possible to hit a thousand god first thank you so much and thank you to you guys for um that we hit a thousand on familiar adventure stay tuned there will be a giveaway um i mentioned it earlier and i always mention all the achievements on the live but we're going to be giving away a starbucks cup so stay tuned i'm going to make a video on that and we'll see you guys on the next one bye familia Bye everyone. Thank you. Thank you, Lizette. Thank you, Claudia. Thank you, Maria. Thank you, Kim. Thank you, Brandon. Thank you, Carpa. Maria. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, we're ending. Say bye. Uh, thank you. Bye. Besos. Oh, no. We might. Looking forward to it. Yes, Antonia. And tomorrow we'll be posting on Family Adventures. 
Yes, every day, every day. Thank you, thank you. Hey, so have a good night too. Thank you, sweetie. Bye. Besos and kisses.